Croatia. The last time we spoke to you guys, we were in Budapest and we were coming to Croatia as our next stop. We kind of just didn't pick up the camera for the past two days because we are exhausted. But we'll talk to you guys a bit more about that later. For now, we need to get to the dock. You heard me right, the dock. We are Sarah and Marek. In October 2020, we left our home country of South Africa and set out to see the world using budget travel strategies to make our travels last as long as possible. From working on a traditional winery in Georgia, to a sailboat in Turkey, to attempting to hitchhike over 1,800 kilometers in four days, our budget travels have by no means been boring or uneventful. We can't wait to see what's next. bought our tickets they told us to get here at least half an hour before because of the mass confusion of this place and today we're actually not taking a bus but we are taking a ferry i'm trying to keep my cool but i'm actually very excited about this this will be our first time using a ferry as our means of transportation with all of our luggage We've only used a ferry once before, that was in Istanbul to get from the Europe to the Asia side. It was a short trip. We're looking at like a two hour ride on this thing. And I guess it's time we mention that we're going to one of the islands of Croatia. Ah! All right. Managed to get it working? Take two. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome. This is so weird. But cool. And just crazy. I guess this is where all the cars go then. Oh wow. Whoa. Marek's gone to find. I don't know, he's just gone to look to see what other options for places we have to sit. Uh, this is not what I imagined. Like, it's really nice, it's not bad, but just not what I thought it would be like, I guess. Hmm. Interesting. Now, when we first started doing research about splits, we found out that it is one of the most expensive places in all of Croatia. And just being here now, and seeing these like surroundings, the mountains and the boats, we can really understand why. On top of it being an amazing way to just cover food and accommodation, the biggest advantage for us and the part that we enjoy the most is that we are just able to connect with people again. We're able to get back onto the ground and just see what it, see a country for what it really is and just experience the culture and to see the country further than what the tourism industry portrays it out to be. And it's just, it's just amazing. We are so excited to just get back with the people again and to just start learning about cultures and the country and just to further our experiences on our trip. Because honestly, the countries that we've gone through so far, if you have to ask us about it, what can we tell you about those countries? We can tell you, oh, it's got really nice food, it's got some really cool looking buildings, but we can't actually tell you much about the culture. And that makes us really sad. It feels like we've been through those countries, but we don't actually know anything about it. We haven't experienced them the way we like to experience countries. So we are just so excited to actually be getting back onto the ground again yeah. and being back with the people. All right, but it is cold. 
Let's go back inside. <laughs> Mary to anyone? It'll be really quick. <laughs> has been using his phone to track our progress to the little island. And we're actually nearly there. Ooh! So for those of you who are interested in finding out how to get tickets, so we use this company right here, this whole website, and it costs us exactly 10 euros for the both of us. That's excluding a little booking fee which actually takes the total price of 12 euros and 23 cents. Now we're not saying this is the best way to do it because we actually think that you can do it cheaper but this is the way that helped us get onto this ferry and it's getting us to the place where we need to be. moments ago that this workaway is one where we receive minimum wage and we aren't provided with food so basically we use the money that we're provided with to buy food so we need to buy groceries now before we get there or before our host picks us up I think this is going to be interesting with all of our luggage walking through a grocery store <laughs> got a message from another worker with us, somebody Friend. to reply to. Ooh. So, maybe we've got our next place booked up as well. Success! Whew. That was a lot of groceries and we hope those last a while. Now we're just waiting for our host. We're on the lookout for a what? Land Rover? Yes. It's still raining so at least he's going to come and give us a ride. Super great. to share this place with you guys. But you're gonna have to wait a little bit for that one. Thank you so much for joining us and we'll see you in the next one. Oh, this one. Oh my 